Just to make sure. <laughs> oh, just to make just sure, huh? Figuring out. <laughs> oh, you're actually being serious. <laughs> yeah, I know. I mean, they, they mix it, huh? So what are we doing tonight? Carbonara. How do you feel about it? Parmigiano. <laughs> quite nervous about it. Really? It was quite complicated. My, my dad sent me the instructions and it's... Yeah, it's different. Let's see how, how it goes. All right. Okay. First, you want to say what is carbonara? Because right. that's not a very traditional pasta right. that we hear of in the US. We have three main pastas that are from Rome and traditional Roman cuisine. Uh, mm -hmm. Amadriciana, which we did last time, mm -hmm. Cacio Pepe, which we did last time as well. And then the last one is uh, Carbonara. Carbonara is a little different because the sauce, the base of the sauce is made with eggs. And they say that the Carbonara recipe comes from World War II, when actually the Americans were in Italy because they were fighting the, uh, the Nazis. Yikes. Some this soldiers. got real serious, <laughs> real quick. Wait, let's get into the pasta <laughs> okay. now. So the soldiers, the American soldiers, have put eggs in the pasta and pretty much that's how carbonara recipe got started. So Americans might have influenced, influenced but Italians actually per created perfected it. Perfected it. Perfected it, <laughs> Italians perfected it. Yes, I like it. Okay, so we start, we put for about four to six people, we put 10 yolks. Only the yolk wow. in the in the bowl, and about 100 grams of pecorino and 30 grams of Parmigiano cheese. Okay. Yeah. say it from the start there is no cream in the carbonara and as a matter of fact there is no cream in any kind of pasta we make yeah sauce, we make, right? sauce yeah a lot of people are always really shocked to find out that italians do not use cream yeah. in their sauces the original recipe is with guanciale it's not that easy to find in the u.s but you can usually easily find pancetta This is guanciale. Guanciale. So you're gonna put both in? Yes, I am. What are you doing? <laughs> Testing again. What wine did you get? I really like this wine. It's definitely my favorite wine right after, I would say, it's Thai with our wedding wine. It's really good. It's okay. from. It's made right next to Rome. Yay! I think we need to upgrade our table settings. <laughs> Why? Like it's perfect. What's wrong with our table setting? Which by the way, I did. So. I know, you set it all up, so I, I think it looks great, but we need to get like actual serving dishes, not just our bowls. <laughs> I don't know, maybe this is normal? We're not really, we were never taught how to serve food for parties at home. <laughs> you guys can let me know. Do you guys have a whole table setting set of stuff or do you just use like your own bowls? Let me know. <laughs> what are we doing now? We are gonna cook the one challenge budget. Okay. What are you doing? Nothing. Just playing around. <laughs> Playing. I'm waiting for the. Oh, okay. I didn't turn on the stove, so I was gonna. Oh! Stop, so. <laughs> Sounds like something I would do. <laughs> A little too big, you're right. I know, they're ginormous. <laughs>
keep this step. I'm gonna cook the pasta pretty much halfway and then finish cooking the pasta in this. Okay. Yeah, should be enough. Wine. Wine? Yes, yes please. please. <laughs> okay, so. Okay, so Lucas, show them how to do a proper bruschetta thing. Okay, depending on what you guys want. This is reg regular olive oil. This is spicy, so this is <laughs> olive oil with chili pepper inside. I like this one, I just want to put this one, but you know, that one. <laughs> so you put the oil first. Okay. You're gonna burn. <laughs> then you take the garlic and do this. And then salt. Oh. Then I like this one with it. Which is stracciatella cheese. Oh my gosh, you guys, it's so good. What is that? Stracci stracciatella cheese. cheese. A type of mozzarella or no? It is. <laughs> and then Rigatoni is tasting. Rigatoni. It's a very important. Sorry, oh. Aria. Oh. 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 It's okay. 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 <laughs> All right. <laughs> and then you finish it up with this one. Yeah. Balsa. And what is that? Oh, more olive oil? Yeah, that's it. No balsamic? No. Balsamic's not an Italian thing. It is, it but is. not on bruschetta. Okay. But we got it exactly. anyways. <laughs> oh. Okay. I'm going to start with the balsamic. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> I cook the pasta halfway in the pot uh -huh. and then I'm gonna finish cooking the pasta in the oil from the fat of the pancetta. Okay. That's it. It's gonna help make like a thin thing. It's gonna make a what? Creamy like oh, sauce okay. with the pasta. When you can see it on the camera, but it's, it's getting creamier. So now we just need to wait until the we finish cooking from on it. This is the hardest part because I turn off the stove. The egg is not supposed to cook. Oh yeah. Because if it cooks, it an omelet, an omelet comes out. So, <laughs> so that's the hardest part. Let's see what happens. Okay, I think we have a carbonara. Yay! I think so, let's see. Okay, any plates? Ooh, yum! Okay. It's flashing. <laughs> Thank you. How is it? This is my best creation. Really? Okay. <laughs> really? My turn to dig in. 